You don't have to look hard to find it. This dumping spot on a vacant lot was cleared within the last two weeks, and today there's more. This trash is just... This dumping is, is, it gets outrageous. Duwand Damon has owned a tidy house near 26th and Vine for 15 years and admits lately it can feel defeating trying to keep up. So I'm constantly out here picking up trash. You know? I'm sick of it, my wife's sick of it. Sometimes the signs stating the obvious are seemingly mocked. Part of it is being lazy. Another part is it's in the inner city and people just feel like, you know, since it's in the inner city, they can do this. It's a lack of respect and, you know, just dishonest people. And it's not just here. We were alerted to this mess in River West by an angry Facebook post about old carpeting dumped in the same alley twice in two weeks. Just this year, we've seen similar instances, some of them caught on video of people using alleys and lots as a free dumping ground. I'm a property, you know, taxpayer, you know, and it's, you know, just to see this, you know, the neighborhood, as you will see, we have another abandoned house over there. And pretty soon, I'm pretty sure the city's going to tear that down. It's going to be the same thing, you know. People are just going to come and dump their trash. And we have been in touch with the city's Department of Neighborhood Services. They're constantly responding to reports about illegal dumping and even run a hotline to report illegal dumping like this. If the information leads to the prosecution of the dumper, the people who call could get up to $1,000. The number of that hotline is 414-286-2489. Reporting live near 27th and Vine, Nick Board of WISN 12 News. All right, there are so many places to do it legally, too. All right, thanks a lot, Nick.